Hey, we're here again with Stuart Baldby. Seems like five minutes ago we were here the other night, but um, this time uh, managed the home win. Strange game, Stuart, in many ways. Started off like a steam train, and then two goals, one of them a penalty, goalkeeper sent off. In a way, perhaps that was the worst thing that could have happened, maybe. Going down to 10 men, allowed them to change things. Yeah, I think, you know, we started off the game really well, um, got a hold of the ball, um, was in full control of the game, I felt, and um, was playing some nice stuff. Obviously got the goal, which I think was well-deserved. Second goal as well from the penalty spot. Um, again, well-deserved. I, I felt we could have probably done maybe another one that half, and I felt that would, you know, three or four might have been a fairer result than what it was, given the goalkeeper got sent off. Um, and then, yeah, as I say, second half was a bit of a damp squid, really. We didn't didn't get going and... and yeah, sort of allowed the game to kind of just peter out without without any sort of, you know, I struggle to think of anything significant really that happened in the second half at all. Because you have to give credit to the wayside for for that, for the way they sort of galvanised themselves with that um, that decision by the ref there. Yeah, definitely. I mean, you know, it was a dead cert sending off, but um, yeah, the the way they set them up second half made them extremely difficult to break down and. And they had a group that, you know, really worked for the management team out there and, and made it really difficult for us to, to, you know, penetrate them and get through and, and get any extra goals. So credit to them as to how they set it up. But but I felt, you know, even second half, you know, they didn't didn't really, you know, create anything and, and, and yeah, the game sort of petered out to a to a two 0 win. So I'm pleased with how we managed the game second half and, 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 and the game management we showed, but um equally a little bit disappointed we didn't go on and, and get some more goals out of the game. Yeah, but I suppose the crucial thing is the three points, of course, this stage of the season, um, which must be delighted with getting back to that. Uh, we've got two away games coming up this week. So, yeah, win today was crucial, wasn't it? Yeah, exactly. We wanted to bounce back after Tuesday's home defeat against Bury, where we weren't really at it. Um, and I felt we did that today. You know, we, we really showed first half that, you know, we got hold of the game. And although I'm a little bit disappointed with the second half, it, it is about... Um, you know, points at this stage of the season. I think that sets us up nicely for um, Tuesday. OK, uh, must be nice to see um, Joe White back today. Oh, I thought he was magnificent, yeah. We've we've took him off near the end because he, he's come back from injury. But, you know, fantastic to have him back. And I, th I felt the skipper was, was outstanding today. Billy was um, head and shoulders, the best player on the pitch by by some distance. And, and um, yeah, Richard deserved man of the match. Excellent. And then, of course, uh, like I said, we've got two... Really difficult, but really um, important away games this week. First of all, East Thurrock on Tuesday away, and then Wake in on Saturday. Yeah, two prepared. tough games. Um, obviously, East Thurrock um, first up, and they've been a little bit hit, hit and miss of, of late, but but they've certainly had a resurgence from where they were earlier in the season. So um, Did lose home to Coggleshaw today. Right, OK. So, yeah, but they'll be a tough side, really tough side, because, you know, Coggleshaw have really turned a corner. Um, so, so they've, you know, to lose one nil to Coggleshaw is certainly no disgrace. So, yeah, it'll be a tough game, and then again, great wagering on Saturday. Be another another tough one, and, and a battling performance needed, I'm sure. Okay, thank you very much.